Researchers improve explosives. Detection accuracy with photoluminescence quenching. A new method for detecting explosives in gas phase environments using photoluminescence. As military and civilian safety concerns rise, effective detection of non-metallic landmines with trinitrotoluene and denitrotoluene is vital. The team used conjugated polymer CP films to detect explosives by observing photoluminescence changes when exposed to DNT. These molecules quench the polymer's photoluminescence, lowering intensity. The study employed a remotely controlled setup to limit exposure to harmful vapors, enabling testing of the PLQ method under near-open conditions. An automatic shutter system managed sensor exposure to explosive vapors, simulating real-world environments where sensors operate without confinement. This allowed evaluation of environmental effects without direct vapor contact. Researchers created a theoretical model to explain photoluminescence changes after exposure to explosive molecules, focusing on exciton diffusion and molecular adsorption dynamics. They found polymer films could recover photoluminescence after brief exposures, indicating potential for continuous real-time monitoring. However, prolonged exposure or high vapor pressures degrade these films. This research enhances explosives detection reliability offering guidelines to improve PLQ sensor robustness. Future studies will optimize sensors and refine algorithms for environmental changes, advancing explosive detection systems.